Do I need Adobe RGB even though I only use my pictures on the web? And the answer to that question is yes, you do. If you were shooting video, you would shoot in the highest resolution you can and downsize from there. When you're shooting stills, you shoot in RAW. You use the greatest megapixel that you can capture at. And then from there, you downsize your files to their appropriate uh, space or the appropriate destination. And the same thing happens with color as well. While you're capturing your images and you have all of this color, you can always remove the colors or alter the colors to fit into a new space. If you have uh, not enough color, you can't just magically increase it. You can always downsize, but you can never increase from there. When it comes to file types, I always keep a layered Photoshop file as my final working file. And then from there, I output the files required for each use. This will give your images greater color gamut, better fidelity, and truer, more accurate representation of what they look like in real life. So if you're really serious about your photography, you should consider using an Adobe RGB monitor such as this one from BenQ.